visual inspection of air filters is not a dependable way to determine change intervals. A filter that looks dirty may still have life left in it. On the other hand, a filter that appears clean may have become too restrictive. You just can't tell by looking at it. So how do you know when it's time to change the air filter? In many cases, replacement at specific intervals may fit best in your overall maintenance program. But again, scheduled replacement doesn't give you an accurate idea of how much unused filter capacity you may be throwing away. That's why restriction gauges are now standard on many types of heavy-duty equipment and are becoming more common on light-duty vehicles. And it's also why Hastings offers a choice of restriction gauge models, which can be specified for factory installation or for retrofitting. Acceptable restriction levels vary by engine manufacturer and are listed in the owner's manual. Over an extended period of time, moisture, engine vibration, flexing, and temperature changes can cause deterioration of the filter media. That's why Hastings recommends that you change your air filter at least once a year, regardless of restriction gauge readings. Hastings does not recommend cleaning or washing air filter elements for two main reasons. First, you can only partially clean the used filter, which means your service intervals will get progressively shorter. Second, you run the risk of damaging the filter when you try to clean it. In either case, the potential for causing a leak or tear that can lead to major engine damage is very real. Hastings has no control over any such procedure, including washing. As a result, Hastings cannot warrant any filter that has been cleaned. Before you throw your old, dirty filter away, be sure to give it a second look. Close inspection may reveal problems that need correcting. For example, a filter with a dust leak may have areas of concentrated dirt on the clean side of the element. A black powdery coating can indicate the air intake may be located too close to the engine exhaust. In either case, make sure the problem is corrected before putting the vehicle back in service. And remember, Hastings Technical Service Department is always available to help you troubleshoot the source of problems you may have with air filter maintenance.